In this video, we will enable automated daily snapshot for Amazon EC2 instance. Log into Amazon AWS console. Search for EC2. Click on EC2 link from the search result. On EC2 dashboard, we have two EC2 instances running. Click on the instance link from the left menu. On this AWS account, we have four EC2 instances. Two of the EC2 instances are stopped. Other two EC2 instances are running. And this is the server I need a daily snapshot taken. Click on the server. Then we need to tag this server. For this, click on the tags. Then click on manage tags. Then you need to add a unique tag name. Yes, okay. Backup daily and set a value yes click on save now we have a tag tag set for the ec2 instance you can verify by clicking on this tags you will see the tag here it is uh, if it is not showing click on the refresh now it is showing the newly added tag next you need to go to the storage uh, normally an ec2 server have only one storage drive uh, on this server, we had two storage disks. We need to add a tag for both of these disks. We will add a tag for the first volume. For that, click on the volume ID. Now go to the tags. Again, we have only one tag. That is for the name. Click on edit add tags. Then click on create tag. Then we have to add the name here. It is auto filled. You can select this one. Then put the value yes. Do you need to do this for other volume also? So go back to the instance. Click on the okay. We we are already on the storage tab here. Click on the second storage volume. We have only one tag now. Add second tag. Click on create tag. This is the tag we need to add for the server. Set the value to yes. Now we have added a unique tag for the EC2 instance and storage volumes. Go to the lifecycle manager from the left menu. Click on create lifecycle policy. Uh, first, first three option leave as it is. No change needed. For the disc description you can enter anything. I will enter daily backup. Then you need to select the tag from this drop down that will be used as a selector. So select the unique tag, then set select its value. Now scroll down, then you need to set a scheduled policy. Uh, here you will select the backup frequency and time. This you can leave it as the default uh, frequency. The default is daily. You can select weekly, monthly or yearly. Uh, we need backup every day. So I select daily and we can select frequency like every hour if you want i only need one backup per day so i select 24 and the backup time you can select uh, set the utc backup time here i set utc 3 am and retention type there is two options i will select age seven days we will keep the backup for seven days scroll down and click on create policy uh, click on close now we are on lifecycle manager here you can see the backup policy if you want to edit you can click on this checkbox and then from actions you can modify the policy delete the policy edit the tags on this page you will see target volumes with these tags if you click on this you will see all the volumes these are the two volumes we will be taking the daily backup click on lifecycle manager again to go back you have the schedule here you can see this will be every 24 hours utc 3 am the snapshot will be retained for seven days if you check after 24 hours you will see the backup taken to see the backups you can go to the snapshot thank you for watching if you like the video please subscribe for more videos like this